today at the famous Monkey Temple. If you are wondering what these monks are doing, they're pitching coins into a gold pot right over there in this wishing well. Coin in the pot, your wish is granted. Now the Monkey Temple, officially called Swayambunath, is composed of stupas, temples, shrines, and more. And here is my guide, Bhupal, to tell you a bit more about Swayambunath. My name is Bhupal. I'm a local guide. And today we are, I mean, the Swayambuna. So this place is called Swayambuna. It's one of the oldest system parks in the world. You can play with the more than 2,000 years ago. No monkey temple would be complete without lots of these little guys. And friends, there are plenty of them right here. Here at Swayambunath, you get a large number of Buddhists as well as Hindus visiting, and it's perhaps the best place to see religious harmony in the entire country of Nepal. This Buddha, made from one piece of stone, dates back to the 7th century. some very, very long lines of locals awaiting a holy blessing. The largest image of the Buddha Sakrimoni in Nepal sits atop this high pedestal. The stupa was completed back in May 2010, its first major renovation since 1921. This dome was regilded using 20 kilograms of gold, and that renovation was funded by the Tibetan Meditation Center of California. Many families, and these kids right here, can be seen walking around the stupa, round and around and around, and frankly, it looked like they were having a great time. The Monkey Temple is a big hike up this hill, but the views are absolutely spectacular. Swayambunath, Swayambunath. And if that doesn't work for you, you can just call it the Monkey Temple in Kathmandu, Nepal. <laughs>